keep floating your bottom. It's spinning me. Hello, everybody. Now I have this turned on so I can't see the time. Oh, it's 401. 401. How's everybody doing? So we're on Mary's phone, so I need everyone to come on and give me a little sound check. There's one person. Comments will appear. How we doing? It's always fun when we go outside. You never know what's going to happen. And... <laughs> sound is good. Awesome. Okay. okay. All right. All right. Give everyone a few minutes to hop on. Hello, guys. So we've got... The weather's kind of funny. It goes from super nice. Well, you can see it. It goes from super nice to dark clouds. I've got a neighbor who never does anything to his house. He decided to buy a gas-powered bush trimmer. The guy can barely walk. We got kids on quads. We got all kinds of good stuff going on here. <laughs> so if uh, we can get through without me throttling someone, we'll be beautiful. So, but on on a, on a much more enjoyable front. As I'm getting ready to do this and, and administer this workout, Mary's going to do the workout, but you guys should check out what she's currently doing. <laughs> that look pretty good? Oh, yeah. Yep. Yep. Let me spin this around. We got 19 people on. There you go. How's that chair? It's, it's nice. So I always find when when pump one is on low, it just push, it just oh, pushed yeah. like a lazy river. It just bounces you around, slowly moving around and around. All right. Sue, I know you have a Challenger 15 deep. I made a note. She's going to laugh. So I wrote this. There you go, Sue. My good friend, Sue. We're going to take care of you today. <laughs> what did you write? Sue, I wrote her name in How to Regulate a Challenger. Oh. <laughs> so there we go. So anyone who's interested, water looks okay. I can be honest with you, I haven't put much time into it. We just do exactly what we've always been doing. There's a little bit of dichlor afterwards and it works out perfectly. Kids are in there. Uh, as you can see, the trees, they're still above, still dropping stuff. Yeah. They come out next week. We got 11 trees coming down, 35 people on here. Mary, you look uh, like you're chilling out in that. It looks good. Yeah. All right. All right, so today, we're going to do a sample workout, and <clears throat> so I, I want to start with a couple of things that you need to know about, you know, anytime someone is administering workout. I'm assuming that everyone who's going to try this workout is, um, has been cleared by their doctor to do so. I'm sure everyone, when they heard we were going to do this, ran right out to their doctor to get clearance, uh, mm -hmm. so that's great. We appreciate that, but, but, uh, but truthfully, if you're doing any of this and it feels wrong, immediately stop. This is a sample workout. It's not gonna be crazy. Uh, you want me to get that? Yeah. Mary wants the raft out of the way. So, just threw it, all, threw it off the deck. So, we're gonna, we're gonna do this, but we're actually gonna do the workout. So it's about 20 minutes. We wrote this out, and it's a nice little interval workout. Gonna do whole body, and uh, with the water is perfectly clear, you should be able to see. Mary is, for those of you guys who don't know, Mary is four foot ten. So some of these exercises, they're actually challenging for her to do them because the uh, the water is so deep on her. Now the sun's coming back out. Yeah. So and I know. I don't, have, I don't have the leverage that a taller person has. We were trying to do some of these exercises and I was looking ridiculous doing them. So, <laughs> well, so I when, when, when she stands there and she grabs the bands that we already hooked up and does curls, she just pulls herself away because yeah. <laughs> so she's not us. tall enough to hold herself down. It's good stuff. So, okay. So what we're going to do, this workout is a whole body. All right. There's not, you don't need any propulsion on here, Sue. You don't need any propulsion until we do a little bit of swimming and we'll play with that. We're gonna go slow through this. So you'll be able to follow along later on after the live is over. Anyone who wants to do it will be able to refer back, should work perfectly, and then you can stop and pause it and it will work great, okay? But it's about 20 minutes and this is what we like to do. Um, when we train some people, this is the sort of things that we like to do and it makes the workout a lot of fun. It makes it interesting. When Mary comes out of here, and Mary had a full training day today, so she's gonna do this after her full training day, and she should feel 
now the sun's going back in, she should feel really great afterwards. So it, it does have a tendency to make you feel like you had a massage after doing a full body exercise you know, routine in the water. It will feel great. So we're gonna hit this, we're gonna start now, and then what we're gonna do, is my watch, yep, still up. So then what we're gonna do is we'll do about 20 minute workout and then we'll do questions. And then of course, you know, some of them during this, I won't be able to see the questions if we're, we're doing the workout, but we will get to what we can. And then after the workout, we'll answer as much as we can. And then obviously tonight we'll get, we'll get on there again. So, okay, cool. All right, so I feel like we should have music, but we can't do that. Oh. Facebook will immediately shut us off if we play music. Oh. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is have Mary come on up on the soft tread. I'm gonna turn the camera around. All right. I don't remember every every move here. So I'm gonna tell you what to do. You were concerned that I wasn't gonna tell you what to do? I wasn't sure how we were doing All right. Okay. Two minutes run in place. So I'll do a little talking while she's running in place. All we're doing is warming up, which is will not take long in my swim spot because that water is 95, 96 degrees. Because that's how we like it. Yes. So two minutes, use a stopwatch. I like to do a lot of the water stuff by time, focus on, on proper form, being safe. So all Mary's doing is she's doing a little warm up, warming up the body, should feel good. Now, if you were watching your heart rate, you could actually put the propulsion on a little bit and then use your arms in a in a swimming motion while you're running in place so that you don't, you know, doesn't push you back and you can involve more muscles. So you can almost do a whole body run in place in a, in a kind of an odd swim type movement while you're running with the propulsion on and it will make your, your heart rate go up and it works really well. So you can control your heart rate. Got about 50 seconds to go, Mayor. So, what we've designed today, Kirk, what's up, man? What we've designed today, we're gonna do, actually, I'll show my cheat sheet. I like to use junk mail envelopes for cheat sheets and notepads. It's a weird habit. I think it drives Beth nuts. All right, we got about 30 seconds left. Running in place. How do you feel, Mayor? My legs are tired. From, from today or from yeah. this? No, no, just, I had a hard run today. We'll do it anyway. I am. Nobody cares. But I feel it. So, it's, I mean, it's definitely working muscles. Do, 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 do. Ten more seconds, and then we're going to do some light stretches, which we will show. All right. All right, Mary, you're good. Okay, so we're going to start with doing a couple of whole body stretches. Well, not at the same time. So what I would like you to do, Mary, is stretch your quads. So let the water calm down a little bit and then you can actually see it. Oh, now the sun, the sun is gonna come out now, so it will be hard to see. I'll see if I can kinda, that kinda works. So what she's doing is she's grabbing her ankle and she's pulling her heel into her butt, okay? And what that's gonna do is that's gonna stretch your quads, the front of your legs. So we're just gonna, we're, gonna, we're not gonna time this, we're just gonna do it for, uh, you know. Really good. Um, it should feel great after your legs are tired. I don't, I'm terrible about stretching. No, and it's, and it's so important, and, you know, and especially in, in this group, and that includes us, none of us are getting any younger. So it, it's important to, uh, you know, to do these stretches. I like to stretch in the water where it's warmer. I get a much better, deeper stretch. What's the next one? Uh, did you do, both, did you do yeah. both legs? Yes. So hamstrings are next. Okay. So what I like to do on the hamstrings is you can just put your foot up on any of these steps. You can see our glorious soft tread. All right. I can see your toes. Did you get your toes done? I don't. I was gonna say. I think I would remember that color. It's like fluorescent pink. Vacation. Vacation toes. All right, that's cool. So stretch. So all, all Mary's doing is she's putting her foot up, and her leg is straight, and she's stretching the hamstrings, and it's gonna go into your hamstrings. It's gonna Just also stretch your calves. Into my... Yep. You don't have to go crazy. No. We're not trying to. We're not trying to set the world record for deepest stretch. Just make it feel good. Warm up a little bit. Both legs, obviously. Yep. You call it, Mare, whenever you're done. I'm good. All right. Next, we're going to stretch shoulders. You know my, my favorite one, right? Arms straight across. You know. You just forgot. I put, I you, on, I put you on the spot. You put me on the spot. 
All right, I'll see if I, like from the shade you can see. So all she's doing is she's extending yeah. one arm across her body and then you take your other arm up underneath and pull, pull it in gently. In, yeah. So all she's doing just like that and it's gonna stretch your shoulder. Don't, don't crank on it because it's a, it's a stretch. All right, so just do that once or twice each side. It's always important to stretch. The older all of us get, it's even more important, I'm sad to say. I'm gonna do this one twice. Go ahead. If it feels right, do it. it. Feels good. Doo -doo. Okay. Cassie Kramer wants to be on your video. I don't think she does. It's funny, I don't know what button you hit accidentally to make that happen, but it's always funny. All right, next we are going to stretch triceps. There you go. So reach straight up in the air. Go slow, Mare, show, show the stretch. Okay, so so reach, reach straight up and then bend down. Back. And then take your behind. other arm and just kind of like pull it in. Elbow. Yep. And you'll feel that tricep stretch. It's funny, when you haven't done these for a while. I know. Uh, so I saw someone post on there. I'll let you do both tri triceps, Mare. Yeah, I saw someone post that they haven't gotten their exercise kit. Make sure it's not inside your cabinet because they leave the factory with the exercise kit in it and it's, it's literally zip tied to the inside of the cabinet. So it's entirely possible that it's inside there and they, they stick it up there pretty far. Yeah. So if you haven't looked carefully, it could be in there. Um, I cannot tell you how many times people have reported no exercise kit when in fact it was inside still. It was just past the uh, the little space where you wire it up. All right, bicep stretch. This is easy. All I want you to do, Mare, you can, you can even grab the back of your palm and then, or you can, there you go. So stretch your wrist, stretch your, your bicep a little bit. Your forearm should feel pretty good. Nothing to it. So if you can see what she's doing there, she's bending this way. There you go. Yep, there you go. We can see it now. And then what was the other one you were showing me? This back here? Uh, you can just do it back, and it's going to pull more on your bicep like that. And, the, and like it, I feel that in like my shoulder blades. Sure, you know, for sure. Yep. Yeah. I mean, when you stretch, if you feel anything, oh, no, back, stretch it. Yeah, no, I, that's what I'm saying. If you feel stretches in, in different spots, go with it. Yeah. You can't, you can't uh, stretch too much. I mean, you can overstretch and get injured, but not by stretching gently on something that feels good. So go for it. All right. Wayne, in the middle of a workout, what's the cost of that swim spa? What's well, the next stretch? <laughs> neck. I'm just putting my chin to my... Are we doing big giant circles? Neck. Um, and then to the... I'm just doing like... We're not doing big giant circles. Are we? No, we're not. Right. <laughs> I was like, I don't think that's right. Like, no, we're not doing big giant stretches because someone on here has got a bad neck for sure. So you're doing everything is on plane. Yeah. To the left, to the right. You can use your hands to help a little bit, but we're not overstretching. We're not yanking. All right. And then back to your yeah, chin up. Should feel good. Yep. Do, do, do. How do you feel? You feel ready? All right, sun gods, one minute. So sun gods are small circles. You're almost too short. I know. <laughs> you know, I you almost you almost need to, to stand on that step. I'll stand on my tiptoes. There you go. So sun gods, all you're doing this here, the sun, you know what, this happened last time. Yeah. In, out, in, out, in, out. Will you tell me when 30 seconds is so I can reverse? Actually, I didn't even start it. Oh. So now I will. So you get an extra 30 seconds. Okay. Small circles, keep them tight. So the Marine Corps loves these sun gods. Man, I can't see if that looks great or not because the sun is, is on the screen. I think, it, I think it looks good. Yeah. You look great. <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure the, the video looks great. Okay, other direction. So with the sun gods, you can do them each direction. So you do 30 seconds to the front, 30 seconds to the rear. If you do two minutes of these, your oh, shoulders yeah. will be on fire. I'm sure you're probably already feeling it. Yep. 15 seconds. Beautiful. 
beauty. Three, two, one, done. Okay, so next thing we're gonna do is two minutes of breaststroke. Now I chose breaststroke because Mary doesn't breaststroke. So I actually want her sort of out of her comfort here. And, uh, and that's what we did. So I'm gonna let you do the, uh, you can handle turning the propulsion on, Mary? Yep. So I'll, I'll give you a little shade. I don't want it at 18. No. Oh. <laughs> if you want to turn those off, you yeah. know what, you better turn them off because it's noisy. Okay, so what did you do? Um, I just put it on um, pump one on low and the other two, the variable speed pumps on six. I'm not sure if it's enough yet, but I, I don't usually do. I'm not sure what I did. So. There we go. Okay. Oh. All right. I didn't bring goggles. Do you want some? Yeah. All right, everybody. We're running to the deck box. Mary, these are goggles. What? You ask and you shall receive. All right. All right. Ready? Two minutes. Go. So you can't critique Mary's form on breaststroke because she's not a breaststroker. She swims freestyle. She never does this. This is way out of her comfort zone. Now, it's also important to mention, if you crank up the propulsion on any of these swim spas, make sure your swimsuit is, uh, is where it should be because we have had several occasions uh, at events where someone lost a, a little bathing suit action. All right. I think she's gonna come out of this out of breath. Now, for those of you watching, this is a Challenger 15 deep. As you know, anyone who knows us knows that I love the Challenger. Sue, that is 6'6 six, six on the VSPs and low. I, I will address that for you specifically when we're done with the workout. All right, she's got 45 seconds left. Keep going, Mayor. Keep going. <laughs> She's going to be tired. 25 seconds. Looking good, looking good. 15. And done. All right. So you've got, I'm going to stop that and back out. All right. All right, two minutes of rowing. You can strip those goggles off. I'm sorry, one minute. The sun is, is so bright on the screen. I think the video looks good. If someone could comment, can you, can you see Mary clearly? How that breaststroke It looked good. Go ahead. One minute of rowing. Now I chose the rowing right now because her arms are going to be a little tired <laughs> and she's going to be like, you did, you, you SOB, you, you did this on purpose. I did do this on purpose. Okay. It looks good. Thanks, Jen. The, the sun is behind me and it's, it's right on the screen. So I can't tell if it looks good, but that's awesome. I'm, I'm glad you guys can see. Perfect. Thanks, Kim. Susan loves the way the sun looks with the water. You got 25 seconds. So now something I want to point out here, what I like to do, I like to squeeze my shoulder blades together. So if you can see, there you go. She's, she's trying to pinch her shoulder blades together. 
That's what you want. You want to use all those muscles and squeeze. It's not always about the weight. It's not always about how hard it is. You can squeeze those muscles and get a great, great workout. All right, two, one, done. All right, now we've got curls. I did this on purpose. So now here. Thank you. Now I, I know I've heard cases where some of the dumbbells were tough to get. So let's get Mary started. You're gonna do curls. Go ahead, Mary. I want her to start that while she's still tired. Now she used her arms for swimming and then did back with the rows, which, which also involves your bicep. So her back and her biceps are already tired. And now I'm doing the bicep curls on purpose to make her more tired because I'm such a nice guy. <laughs> you feel it? Yeah. Good. No, I mean, this is a good workout. Oh, I know. Yeah. It should feel, but it, it, I want it. I mean, I, I'm, I'm busting on you a little bit no, just because it's fun, yeah. but I, it should feel good. Yeah. I just really don't do brush because well. <laughs> we don't swim that stroke that's why i chose it though i took you out of your comfort zone yeah. hey it was good progress is made out of comfort zones right yep. uh, you of all people know that okay you got about 10 seconds left sorry if i'm shaking on the camera holding guys i'm trying to time it at the same time and read this done okay you can pop those up pop them up on the far side all right so now what we're going to do I want you to grab the rowing bars and I want you to grab them backwards and do chest press with them. Okay. You're gonna have to really lean forward because yeah. you're so little and get a, as much of a footing as you can. This is where, you know, I really love the soft tread guys and this is one of the reasons why. She does not have rubber shoes on. Um, let me start the clock and go. So put your hands in the water. I like that angle better. There you go. Looks good. And then on the extension, you can squeeze your chest a little bit. So I, there were a few cases where I had heard the dumbbells were unavailable. So we were able to find some different kinds on the, uh, we showed them on a live on Amazon. Uh, these are the ones that, that Master provides. Uh, they're, they're great. So, but the other ones were great too. So get what you can get in there. You can also use bands. So this is just one way to do it. There's a million ways to skin this cat. All right, looking good, Mayor. How you feeling? Good. Chest press, chest press. One of her legs, Jackie, one of her legs is on the step and one is on the bottom because she's got to brace herself. All right, done. All right, drop those down. All right, next thing we're gonna do is tricep extensions. Yep. I just happen to have this little bad boy ready for you. So what I did was in your kit, you've got a strap. I wrapped it around a couple times and then put one band on there, two bands, Mary pulls herself out of the water. All right, Mary, go ahead. Nobody likes flabby back arms. This is gonna address that specifically. Doing a good job, you're tall enough, Mary. This is one of the few exercises in the deep one that Mary actually can do no problem. Mm -mm -mm. Thirty-five seconds. This will this will burn. Yep. This will your triceps will burn from this. If you need to, if you can't make the minute, it's not a problem, guys. Do as much as you can. If you want to take a little tension off, get a little air. Make sure you're breathing deeply. Breathe every repetition. Okay. On the exertion, so like right. Now, she should be breathing out, then it forces you to breathe in. All right. Where is the row bar app? I, I don't know about that, Sherry. I don't think there's an app for the row bars. Uh, let's see. Keep going, Mayor, keep going. Done. All right, now, we got one-legged squats. Okay. So these are kind of funky. And those of you who've been around us, you know I, I've demonstrated these before. So what I want Mary to do, place one foot up on that first bottom step where, where the M is. Yep. All right. So what I want you to do is put your left, kind of scoot over to your left, and then grab that handle. Okay. Okay? There's a couple ways you can do this. So you can do one squat on one leg. So put the back foot up so that you're only using the one leg and fully extend right there. We're gonna do a minute each leg. Okay. Everybody see that? 
There you go. I feel these. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is the way I like to do them. There's lots of different ways. And remember, guys, if, you, if your knees, if you've got bad knees, people go to swimming because of bad knees. So it's super common. So if your knees are, are in bad shape, don't do this one, all right? There's lots of things you can do. You can do it without the step underwater where there's much less resistance and it may not hurt your knees because the, the water is the equalizer. So if anything hurts, we want you guys to stop, okay? All right. Adam Clark, how often do the pumps in this model overheat and shut off? Literally never one single time. I wonder what you got going on there, if you've got that going on. Does he have a trainer 15 and maybe they're just going off on the timer? Maybe. But if you have a, the H2X trainer series, the pumps will go off every 15 minutes yep. uh, for safety. Reasons. Switch legs. There you go, she's switching sides using her other leg. Yeah, we'll need a little bit of uh, clarification on what's going on. Too, you can, um, if you, a little more advanced, if you don't use the handle, give you a little bit more balance. Sure, yeah. if you can do it, no problem. Yeah. Becky, can you leave the equipment in the spa all the time? I do, you probably shouldn't. Um, I have a lot of bad habits that you should not necessarily do. Um, although everyone loves the Ben method of chemicals. And as you can see by my water, it works. So anything you can do without holding on is going to use more stabilizers and synergist muscles. So it's always good. So like Mary said, if you, if you want to increase some balance, don't hold on if you can. And those wobbles that you might feel are actually very good. All right, keep going. You got about 10 more seconds. How important is the slip grip? Slip grip. I love it. Yeah. Jen, I love the slip grip. We're using that. We didn't order them because we heard they peel up. Um, I've never had one peel up. I think that the, as far as working out goes, it's critical. Otherwise, you find yourself in rubber shoes. Yeah. Kathy, come on over. Done, Mayor. Okay. Okay. So now we've got run in place two minutes. Okay. I'm going to do kick, butt kicks. Butt kicks. Last time I did hiding. <laughs> this, the sun is... I think the water looks great. I, I can't... I can't see because the sun is so bright on the screen from this side and the sunglasses make it worse somehow i'm trying to get in the shade so what mary's doing is she's focusing i'll see if i can see this what she's doing is she's trying to kick her heels and actually touch her butt while she's running in place okay the first two minutes at the beginning i just did high knees like running in place, but I decided to do something different. Mix it up a little bit. Susan, all my soft treads were replaced after six months. Were they were they installed in the field or at the factory? That's pretty rare. But it can be. I mean, it's yeah. We have yeah. Replaced. We've had it. We've had it. We've had it. We've seen it a couple times. But I I do love the soft tread. Yeah. Robert Sarbone. In fact, we had somebody. Um, comment just on how great it felt like on her knees it's and, great yeah, yeah. I, i'm a huge fan i mean if if even if they came up all the time i'd still want them and and do whatever i had to do to keep them uh that's just it's such a huge difference and i, I have worked out in these without one yeah and okay. uh, without and it's very slippery uh for exercise you know for for hanging around and and you know chilling out not a not a problem but all right you got about 30 more seconds okay Go faster. So now we're gonna start the second. Mike Wright, I wouldn't buy a trainer or challenger without the soft tread, I agree. Hi Mike Wright. What the heck kind of plane was that? We got all kinds of weird stuff going on up here. All right, and you are done. So now what we're gonna do is row in place. All right. One minute. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Make it happen. Ready? Yeah. Go. Squeeze those shoulder blades. I don't want to see that tension come off of there, Mary. No cheating. Don't don't shortchange yourself. The only person you're cheating is yourself, Mary. <laughs> She's like, shut up. Mm -hmm. I should have put my watch on for a workout. 
you should have counted this. You you may want to put a manual workout in. She, you you definitely should get credit. Are you you feeling it? Yes. You feel good though, right? Oh yeah. Good. I I wanted I'll to add another 20 30 minutes to my strength. Absolutely you should. Got about 10 seconds. Done. Grab the dumbbells, bicep curls. Yeah, the water, you know what? Susan is right, the water looks great in the sun. Are you ready and go. You guys can tell I'm really timing this because you can hear my watch beeping. So now with the dumbbells, and that's any kind, whether it's these ones or a different kind or whatever, the faster you move these particular type, they create more resistance. They're really well done. You know, what's, inter what's also interesting to me is that normally when we do exercise, we don't get that many viewers, and we've got 77 people on here oh, viewing all at the great. same time, which is cool. That's yeah. great. And then we did have that one question. I'm sorry I don't remember your name, and we did not write it down today just because we had one. But someone asked about the best way to train a <laughs> trainer 15 deep. Yep. During, during the set, she's doing this. Go ahead. <laughs> but the best, the best way to do it, honestly, is to get a small sump pump and pump the water out. No question. It takes a long time. Yeah, no question. There is a gravity drain, you know, behind where your pumps are. There's a drain. I have never used it. Up to, but it takes a long Done. time. Hi, Leslie. All That's right. Nice. Put those up. You got curls. Chest press. Get over there, hurry up, before, before you catch your breath. <laughs> like, like old days, right? Yeah. With me cracking the whip. GK, awesome, thanks for the video. You are very welcome. Oh, I gotta turn the watch on. Susan loves the water mirror. Great. Susan, you're totally right on this one. The water looks great in there. Every time the sun goes in I can see the screen and it looks great Sue Elkins I've burned 800 calories just watching Mary <laughs> I, I wish that's, how much that's how you do it 20 minutes. I burn like 80. <laughs> the joys of being a little person small girl problems yeah. Priscilla can this go inside your home it can you're gonna need a big door comes in one piece actually we do see a lot of garages though yeah. and, and rooms built specifically for them <clears throat> done tricep extensions this one's gonna burn and go What is the temperature range? Temperature range is 80 to 99, unless you turn the dip switch off and then 100 to 104. I have my dip switch turned up, so in case I wanna make it a giant hot tub, we can. Don't take that tension off there, Mary. Watch, your triceps are sore from this, I'll laugh. <laughs> they probably will be. Two, when's the last time you did a solid minute like that of two burners? <clears throat> well, and those, when you do the bicep curls, you're getting the tricep going down. Yep, with the dumbbells, sure. Yeah. And done. All right, one leg squats. And if you, if you want to use one of the higher steps and put more tension, show how to put more tension on there. Not that one. <laughs> it's too high. You'll be, at, you'll be on the roof. Use that one. One minute each leg. Mm. 
Lorena, I will show you how the tension band is attached. Absolutely, let's, let's do this and then I'll do that. Sue Olson, I didn't forget about you. Don't you worry. How much more do you feel that? Significantly. Right? Yeah. You don't have a workout tomorrow, right? Nope. Well, good. Make it hurt then. Now I know Sue's paying attention because I said that and she said hi. <laughs> awesome. Done. Switch legs. And go. Tanya, I leave them in. Um, we've, we've left them in in the warehouse and I've left them in here. Um, probably shouldn't. This exercise burns. Yes. <laughs> Susan, this exercise burns. Someone said that? Yes. <laughs> Susan, I'm, I am so sorry that that burns. Can you feel me laughing? <laughs> now you guys understand that I, I started all this as a trainer. How we got started was uh, I wrote the exercise program for the Michael Phelps Swim Spa years ago. That was how all this began, was uh, me being an SOB trainer. Almost done. Done. I would like you to warm down, cool down, warm down, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. Run in place one minute only, nice and gentle. Just chill out. Do you want your float back? <laughs> oh, no, I'll sit in the back. Thank you so much for this video. We get our trainer 19 August 20th. Awesome. Oh yeah. GK, injured back and knee, so we just bought one. I'm, I'm, so far I'm loving it. Have yet to try the exercise equipment. It is really superb. Just get your body moving and, and start feeling better. Heard something over there. Pamela, watching from in our trainer. Yes, that's what we were looking for, everybody. Bought a trainer 15D and love it. Awesome, we're so glad. Done, Mayor. All right. All right, all right. Let me get rid that of that. That was a good workout. Though. How do you feel? Great. You should feel, you know, every time I do one of these, I feel like I had a massage and I, and I did some exercise. There's no, when you're doing anything that's land-based, you have gravity to deal with and it never makes it feel better. Where you do this, you work the muscles, you're not going to be sore, and it just feels fantastic. But when you get done afterwards, the blood is flowing properly, yeah. the temperature is right. It's, it's just fantastic. All right, so, okay, can you show your decking around the swim spa, Cassie? Yes, I will. Let's do this. All right, so first thing I want to do is show what I did here, okay? I'm only using one hand. So this strap I just wrapped around. And then this is, this is the, can you see that? That was all I did. I wrapped it around. You don't even have to wrap it around, you know, just one underneath it and it will work. So that's, that's all I did there and uh, works really, really well. And I did one, um, when I do it for me, I use two. So I hook up one on each one because I'm stronger obviously and bigger than Mary is. So I, I use both bands. Okay. So then let's talk to Sue. All right, Sue, this is for you, all right? So if you want to control in the Challenger, I had a specific question today on, our, on the, the master owners group. You go right here, that's your workout, okay? Then you get manual workout, timed workout, workout program, or workout settings. I'm trying to hold the, the phone and do this at the same time. 
So you I like. Hold the phone for you? I think I got it. Okay. So I like manual workout. Then you see this. Now it's starting in three seconds. Okay. So we'll let it start. So right there, that's pump one. Okay. So I just turned it off. So that's pump one, not VSP. That's just pump one. So I'm going to put it on low. That's low. One more, it goes to high. And then adjust speed. That's both VSP pumps. So if you want to adjust it a little bit, you can turn it up a little bit. So now, unless you're a crazy strong swimmer, if you put the pump one on low and then use the VSPs, the water's really, really smooth. So I'm going to put this up to about 15 and watch how smooth that water is. It's gorgeous. That is a gorgeous current. Okay, and it's not, there's, there's no turbulence. So that's enough for most people to swim on unless you're swimming really, really hard. Okay, and you can turn it up. So I'm just, I'm gonna turn it up a little bit more. That's 22. So now I've got the main pump one. Look at that, it's going for a ride. Let me get that out of here. Now you can see we're moving some water there. You can see just how much it's surrounding Mary. Oh, yeah. But it's, it's smooth as glass. It's just fantastic. And, and this is why, you know, I have a super special soft spot in my heart for the, uh, you know, for the Challenger. So this is it. I use the timed option, same pump. Yes, Sue, if you use the timer, it's the same thing. Now, what's kind of cool, and I'm not sure if the gentleman before his question was in, in regards to this, is the workout an option in the controller? I was does not have this. The trainers do not have this. This is the Challenger, okay? And that's what I'm wondering if when his pumps timed out at 15 minutes, most most of the, your trainers or all of your trainers are going to time out at 15 minutes if you turn these pumps on. Uh, on the Challenger, you have the main panel, which is the same as the trainer, and then you have the workout control panel, and that's on the Challenger, okay? So you have all these controls, and then if you want to see, like, I'll turn it all the way up. Hold on, Mayor. Yep. Now I'll put this pump on high. Boom. Now that thing is moving water. You are swimming real fast there. That's fantastic. Okay, then to shut it off. Shuts everything off. Manual workout. Goes back to time. So, Sue, the timed workout is the same thing. And you can, when you do that from the challenger on the exercise side, you can actually do that and it won't shut off for an hour. You can set the timer for wherever you want and it won't shut off. You know, you can have it go up to an hour. Um, if, you, if you're swimming long, that's a nice thing. On a, on a trainer 15 or 19 or whatever, you're going to have to turn those pumps back on after 15 minutes. Okay. And this is why, you know, we, how we kind of describe this, if you're looking for hardcore swimming, you're going to want to do the Challenger or the Michael Phelps. If you're looking for recreation mostly, then the trainer. Now, yeah, the Challenger features are, are great. It still doesn't change the fact that the Trainer 15 is the number one most sold swim spa on the planet. I mean, it's on Earth by 100 miles. You can't go wrong with it. It's fantastic. And we have trained in them. We've, I have had one before. So it works fantastic. This is just a, a different feature. Okay. So next question we had, someone wanted to see my decking around. So I can show you that. Now, when we put it in, I haven't done anything else because I've been stupid busy okay mama's home so she's like oh my god they put the camera on me so this right here this is 60 inches tall this is a challenger 15 so it's one foot below it's not in the ground i've got a slab actually i'll take you over here and show you this so you can see it goes all the way down you can see where my electric goes in so that's that's the slab. So that it doesn't look like it there, but that is 12 inches. That's a two by 12 on its side. Okay, and then, and I did this. I'm not a carpenter, but it came out pretty well. Hi. Hello. So, and I just shaped these around. Beep. And then on the upper deck, we did that. Can you see that? So this this bottom deck started off 
from that corner years ago to that corner was 16 by 16. And then we added the breezeway when we did the garage in this part of the deck. And then this upper deck we did afterwards because when we put where the hot tub used to be, we ate up all the decks. So we did this upper deck, which I believe is it's 16 wide and I uh, 12, if I'm not mistaken, 12 deep. Okay. And that's it, guys. Any, any, let's see, let, let me scroll through. Camera's on you, Mayor. Hi. So don't like pick, pick at your face or anything. I'll try not to. <laughs> All right, let's just see if I can. Pamela, we love the trainer 15 for swimming, trained for 10K. Absolutely. You can't go wrong with yeah. it. It works great. I'm scrolling, I'm scrolling. Timed option. Sue, did I answer your question? Let me know if I didn't, because we can go into it further. But just take that speed in both VSPs down. Off topic, but have you explained the vacation mode in one of your videos? I've never even used the vacation mode, if I'm being 100% honest. Do, do, do. I didn't even know there was a vacation mode. <laughs> Mixed. <laughs> Mary. <laughs> Well, if I'm being honest, I didn't either. <laughs> All right. So, hi from Houston. Thank you for this video. We love our 15 deep. I love your 15 deep, too. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. Our cement pad is being laid right now, like as we speak, Maureen. That's cool. fantastic. Do, do, do. Bad knees, Carol. Only way to get heart rate up without pain. Fantastic. Yeah. Showed the decking. Oh, now the sun's out. I can't see the. I, see I can't it. see anymore. I have the weirdest face on. The sun is, is bright. Okay, right on. All right, so I think that's it. Yeah. I think we're gonna we're gonna hop off here. So we will see you in two weeks, which brings us to August 11th. I can't see Wednesday, it at all. Wednesday, August 11th, I believe. I know I can see your little head, pointy head in the background. And uh, and we'll be back for Facebook Live then. But um, go. Two weeks. You can go back and replay the video and do this do this workout or any portion of it. Yep. Um, at any time so we hope you enjoyed it. it was a little something different today um so we're happy we're happy you joined us oh mayor susan yeah. susan said dancing in the swim spa is a fun workout too i've never thought of that yeah i'm not a huge dancer but Me neither, absolutely but absolutely I, like, I think that would be fun i think it would be exceptionally yeah. tiring for you uh, with your height right yeah yeah right Good on idea awesome guys so we'll see you in two, two weeks. weeks uh remember if anything hurts during this workout stop yeah. that's it you don't need to do that don't get hurt um, everything should feel great if it doesn't feel great doing something wrong always send us a message we want to hear from you and uh, thanks for watching guys we love you we'll see you in two weeks Bye. I can't see the button at all <laughs>